As ironic as it may sound, did you know that there's plenty of BL actors that are actually homophobic in real life? Someone who literally admitted to doing BL dramas just for the fame and money is Mean Pieravid, who's most known for his role as Tin in Love by Chance. In an interview, he explicitly stated that he might consider doing BL dramas again once he's old and in need of money. This left a very sour taste in everyone's mouth because it made it seem as if he was only doing BL for money. Him stepping away from starring in BL dramas in general upset a lot of people because it's literally what built his career. It makes it seem like he only continued to star in these types of dramas to reach a level of fame that he was satisfied with. On the surface, his comments regarding the genre came across as weirdly homophobic, but his fans claimed that he didn't mean it in a derogatory way. People who defended him claimed that he actually meant that he's stepping away from being on screen and wants to do more work behind the camera. Others say that he might be over the genre after having filmed a lot of similar dramas. The fact that he directed the 2021 BL drama The Yearbook is often used as an argument that he's not homophobic, but just wanted to do a different style of work. What doesn't really help this case is that he was also accused of mistreating Earth, which is one of his co-stars in Love by Chance. Earth happens to be an openly gay actor, so it threw a very bad light on Mean. Artin Aiden, better known as Jung, is yet another BL actor that has openly made homophobic comments in the past. Back in 2019, he starred in the second installment of Two Moons, which is what made him pretty famous. At some point, he decided to answer fan questions on Instagram, and a few of his Turkish fans fans had questions regarding his sexuality. They started to question whether he was gay in real life because they had seen him star in Two Moons. As a response, Jung said, I'm a man in real life, not gay, which angered many people as it implied that he doesn't consider homosexual men real men. Production company Motive Village then released a statement regarding the situation, asking for forgiveness and revealing that Jung was put on probation for his behavior. His actions barely had any consequences though because he continues to star in BL drama since that's what he's most famous for. Sure, his career might have taken a small hit at the time, but he's still earning money through BL despite his homophobia. Next up is Chris Pirawat, who has a long list of controversial behavior to his name. You probably recognize him in his role as Artit in the drama Sotis. Accusations of him being homophobic started to rise when he handled questions about his sexuality in a very tasteless way. On Instagram, a fan asked him if he was gay. To this, he responded with, absolutely no, while adding a bunch of angry emojis to his reactions. This did not slide with the public at all, because it looked like Chris was not comfortable with being associated with queer identity whatsoever. Fans expressed that he didn't have to be so negative with his response, as he made it seem like being gay is inherently a bad thing, when in fact he's the one who stars in gay TV shows. Others argued that maybe he reacted that way because he was tired of all the speculation regarding his sexuality. Although you might already not want to give him the benefit of the doubt in this scenario, it really only gets worse. There are rumors that he insulted a fan for assuming that he and his co-star were dating in real life. But the most terrible part is that he allegedly said that he doesn't enjoy watching the scenes between two men because it's not something that men want to watch. Not very tasteful of him to say considering he literally earns his money by playing queer characters. A prime example of a homophobic actor is God Itipad, who's mostly known for his role as Pana in Two Moons. He is a very controversial individual to say the least. In the BL community, there's a big rumor going around that he actually didn't like starring in Two Moons at all and that he only chose to play the role to gain recognition. Although there was no clear evidence to back this up, it was said that Two Moons was originally planned to have three parts. In the second part of the series, the entire cast was changed and fans have been wondering why that happened. Allegedly, God was no longer willing to star in the drama and only completed filming for the first part. It said he has no plans to star in BLs at all anymore. Some fans were enraged, saying that it's extremely disrespectful to choose a BL drama to kickstart your career, knowing it has three parts to then decide to never complete it. Others claimed that the recast was actually caused by contractual problems and had nothing to do with the actors themselves. However, God has shown more fishy behavior while on the set of Two Moons. There's this behind the scenes video of him and his co-star Bass kissing, only for God to weirdly wipe his lips right after. Fans question why you would agree to kiss a guy if you're going to start spitting and cleaning your mouth with a disgusting face afterwards. Not only did God act disgusted in the behind the scenes footage, he allegedly also asked for kissing scenes to be removed because he didn't like them. There are fans who came to his rescue and claimed that he only acted disgusted because both he and Bass were very nervous. A fan explained that it was God's first scene of that kind and that he didn't have any prior acting experience. On the other hand, it was Bass's first real life kiss, so he was very shy. Not many people buy this version of the story though. A big part of the public believes that God was actually embarrassed to play a gay character and even disgusted to complete the steamy scenes with his on-screen partner. Another well-known BL actor that doesn't have the cleanest reputation is Golf Kanaut. Although he rose to fame and earned a lot of 
money due to the support of his queer fans, he has made some very out-of-pocket comments in the past. There's footage of him talking about what he was like in elementary school. In the video, he explained that he used to be friends with a guy who was a bit more feminine and that he would mock him to the point that he cried. In the video, he shares that he doesn't remember exactly what he did to him, but clearly it was severe enough to make the boy burst out into tears. The most horrible part is that he claimed it was fun for him to do this at the time. Considering that gay men are stereotypically portrayed to be feminine and very looked down upon for this, confessing to having mistreated a guy for being more girly is a horrible thing to do. It's even worse that Gulf admitted this with a smile on his face, enraging everyone that watched it. He's also been cancelled for mocking disabled people, so it's safe to say that he isn't very loved by the public. Om Pawat was also under fire for making comments that were borderline homophobic. Having been in the industry since 2016, he built quite a name for himself, only to ruin it in 2019 with a controversial Facebook comment. The controversy started with a picture of a bunch of shirtless men that was posted on Facebook. Om then commented on this picture in Thai, but what he said could be seen as very offensive. He called the men in the photo something along the lines of a gay gang, which according to some Thai people is used in a derogatory way. Some of Om's fans jumped to his defense, claiming that the language barrier makes it seem offensive and that he didn't use the term negatively. Others say that it's not surprising if he is actually homophobic because they believe that he only starred in BL dramas to become famous and earn money. Making homophobic comments isn't the only problematic thing that he's done because Om was also accused of mistreating an autistic child at his former school. For this, he eventually apologized, but there are a lot of people that can't look past these terrible actions. Unfortunately, the list doesn't end yet because BL actor Bill Tuckapon is also considered extremely problematic. Although he started his career around 2017, he got more famous after he starred in BL drama Kim Porsche. Over the years, he has made several offensive comments towards numerous marginalized groups. A comment made in 2021 resurfaced in which he uses a word in Thai that is used to discriminate queer people in feminist groups. He has made several offensive comments towards women as well and has allegedly defended people who force themselves on others. His agency eventually released a statement on the situation claiming full responsibility for his actions. Build himself also wrote an apology reacting to the allegations. As a result, he wasn't present at the premiere of the last episode of Kim Porsche. Despite his controversial past, he still has a lot of fans who stick beside him. The last actor on this list is Noul, who starred as Rain in Love in the Air. Similar to a lot of actors on this list, he too was caught being homophobic in his old Facebook posts. Pictures of him making very inappropriate jokes resurfaced, which had no one laughing. Noel made some very weird jokes related to themes of being attracted to minors, forcing yourself on others, and he even got caught calling something gay in a derogatory way. This type of behavior just shows that the person you see on screen might be a totally different person once the cameras stop rolling. Some fans claim that Noel was very young when this happened, but it's up for debate whether that excuses his behavior. What do you think about this? Let us know in the comments. Thanks for watching. Bye.